All right. Let's go ahead and make the big bucks. I need more space already. Some gotta go. Some gotta go. Some gotta go. I'm holding too much crap. Some gotta go. What's going to go? What's going to go? Welcome. Well then, what can I do you for? Sell. Give me the money. <laughs> Thank you. Yep, got me a little achievement or whatever. Now, anything else I can help you with? What I could do is. Why not try your hand at a new gun, stranger? Might save your life. Molding a weapon to suit your specific needs. <laughs> it's a thing of beauty. I wish it told me from here. Oh, it does tell you. Okay, I'm, I'm lying. The riot shotgun takes up... What's that? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 16 blocks in my case. If I, if I trade it in, got this, I'll have way more room. And then I can keep stuff. Let's do it. Let's uh sell... See, I'm like, see, I, I'm gonna tell you guys this. This is something a lot of games need when they have a. Would you shut up? <laughs> let me let me say what I'm trying to say without him humming. A lot of games need this, and what is it that they need? The, the thing that makes games, at least for me, so cool is when a developer or a team knows to make everything matter. Everything. And the discovery of finding out it matters. So what I mean is, and I won't go too long so we can get into playing. The fact that I have to think about the bullets, crafting, all that matter it's not like it's a it's just there and it don't really matter because they give you so much other stuff it just it becomes irrelevant finding the treasure because you need money to buy stuff and it, you don't get a lot of money by just killing enemies being strategic and holding off from selling something because i could potentially find better jewels to slot in a item and get more money Holding off on using healing items because I might find a yellow herb so I can then get more health. Deciding to trade in a gun that I may like because I'm going to get a lot of money. But then I might save on space. And then all that money can use to upgrade the next gun. The economy. The There's games that's like that. Like um, if you got a Switch. And I think it's on PC. Uh, what's that game called? I'm brain farting. Bravely Default 2. Everything in that game matters. Side quests give you classes. Side quests give you armor and weapons. That's one of those RPGs where you don't have to be a certain level to get a certain piece of equipment. So it's kind of like as you play through the game in a normal story, the game is naturally going to introduce better weapons. But if you do side quests, you can get those better weapons earlier than you would if you just play through the plot and then wait until it dropped from an enemy because as you play through the game better weapons will drop naturally but you could do a side quest and get it earlier and all the systems go together i like when games do that versus a game just uh a game doing something like um Oh, we got all this money, but you don't. You get all this money, but there's nothing to do with it. Kind of like. Ruby's all rubbish. It makes no difference. The price. Well, that's our choice to make. Kind of like, uh, like most GTA games, or oh, all of them actually. Ah, 
anything else I can help you with? You'll be shooting off some nasty fireworks in quick succession with that. Dazzled, are you? <laughs> Our craftsmanship demands no less. See how that feels, mate. Fellow like yourself should notice the difference right away. Easy work. Crossing your T's, dotting your I's, that's the way to be. Yeah, we're gonna go with that right there. Well, then, what can I do you? And exclusive upgrade ticket. We're gonna save There's for that. Some things money can't buy. These other two pistols, uh I'm probably gonna get them on another playthrough or something. Pleasant track. And that's another thing too about ecosystem. The fact that the game wants you to play the game multiple times. So you can't really do everything in one playthrough giving you incentive to play it again like i know there's a lot of people again going back to replay value they feel like replay value is only in content that they haven't done like technically even though i haven't used those guns i haven't bought them somebody else will play this game and say well that doesn't really matter so technically i beat the game once there's nothing else to do side quest well that's just side quest i don't care i beat the main thing it's nothing else to do this game is trash return to gamestop uh i mean that's your business this your money but or like someone will say Elden Ring has a bunch of stuff to do, so it has a lot of replay value. I would say, yeah, Elden Ring has a bunch of stuff to do, but you're doing the same thing over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. And it's not fun either. So that's another part of it. But that's just me. And liquid nitrogen showers. That's just me with Elden Ring. Elden Ring has a crap ton of stuff to do. It's repeated content. Multiple like it's it's so much repeated content in Elden Ring. I already went on an Elden Ring rant, and I don't mind going on another. But I think I'm going to hold off for just right now. I'm trying to think what my next game would be to stream. Why do I keep saying stream? My next game to be to record and do a playthrough of. Like I said, I got Yakuza Like a Dragon. I could do that. I got... um. Strangers of Paradise. But I think I'm going to pick another short game. Those games are long. I could do another Resident Evil. I got Revelations 2. Which I just recently beat. And I need to run through it again. I got um, Resident Evil 6. I got Evil Within 1. Which I beat on PC. Never beat on console. I got a lot of stuff man. That we can play through. These people are not. I might do the Uncharted series, cause or um, Jack and Dexter or something. Um, I need Circuit Breaker. Okay, I think that's that invisible guy, if I'm not mistaken. Or not the invisible guy, the guy that regenerates. It's one of them, I don't remember. Don't you like use on the regenerator like a heat? Uh, therm a thermal uh, scope and you can kill it that way or is that a different enemy I don't remember oh 
Oh, I could play, uh, I don't know how I would do that, because, well, right now, because my channel's stuff is low, I won't get monetization anyway, but they still might take the video down. I would definitely play the classic GTA 3 Vice City and San Andreas on here, because I still had them on, those on PS4, not the remakes. I would love to play those, but, I mean, I could play them without them getting copyright claimed. I just have to turn the music off, but honestly, I don't even grant the photo games without listening to the radio is kind of kind of lame maybe I could turn on the talk radio oh up 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 wow okay that kind of remind me of that uh that alien um isolation game I don't like that game I played it on Game Pass. It is not for me. It's hide and go seek the video game. Not my not my style. Uh Let's craft some stuff. It is hide and go seek the video game. Just not my cup of tea. I hope Microsoft doesn't get the Activision Blizzard deal. Not because of COD or, I'm, or I like Sony. It's only because Microsoft is 100% getting away from physical media. And, um, yeah. The reason I'm saying they're getting away from physical media is now, thankfully, with what's that game, Redfall, Creedfall, whatever it's called. Um, that game is always online, even though you could play the game completely by yourself, single player. And it like, it doesn't make any sense. No game that you could play completely by yourself, single player should require online internet. None. It's, it doesn't make any sense. Now they did say they were trying to remove that by launch. So before the game ships, hopefully you don't need the internet to play by yourself good but then there's the I don't know if the game is on disc Microsoft has been doing funny stuff with disc um, where first you got smart delivery now smart delivery is how do I explain it smart delivery is really just the same thing as the PlayStation like this game right here this is the PS4 version on the box it says free upgrade to PS5 version so basically when you, I pop this game in it's going to say this is a PS4 game and the PS5 but it has the free upgrade so you could get the upgrade for free we'll let you download the PS5 version but you cannot you can only play it with the disc in the system so the disc is used as a key so I can play the digital PS5 version that's fine because guess what I can always do if I want the physical uh, copy of the PS5 version go to the store and buy it so it's not a issue like both versions exist like the physical ps5 version exists the physical ps4 version exists um great with xbox a lot of those games are smart delivery there is no xbox series x version it's only the Xbox One version. And that's what's on the disc. So when I say for Xbox Series X, they're really getting rid of disc. It's because there's barely any Xbox Series X disc, disc only games. Barely. For every PlayStation 4 game that gives you like a free upgrade. Ooh, that saved me. That's cool. For every PS4 game 
that gives you a free upgrade the ps5 version also exists So, um, let's combine but anyway, where I was, where was I going with my rent? So yeah, Microsoft getting rid of this people. They're getting rid of this. They're trying to do always online. A lot of their games not even rele releasing on this. They're doing like Halo. There was no, like for Halo to not be on this is crazy. That's like the game that represents Xbox. No physical, well, let me be clear. It's a physical copy, but there's nothing on the disc. When I mean there's nothing on the disc, I mean when you pop the disc in without being online, it's literally just a menu that tells you ne you need to be online to download the, the game. Wow. Leave me alone. Wrong way. Because I was going to go with uh, Xbox over PS5 only because with them having those deals and those games, if we're talking about exclusive versus exclusive teams, I would prefer what Xbox has to offer with exclusives because Bethesda, I'm, I play, I like Bethesda games more than most Sony games nowadays. I like Activision games more than Sony games nowadays, but now that uh they're not doing disc and it's still a bunch of funny stuff with drm and all that stuff i would probably get an xbox series s but that's only for um yeah, you can emulate the xbox series s you can use emulators on it and it's not expensive it's not like it's 500 dollars, like 200 bucks so 200 dollars for a good emulating box is and then if there's ever a digital game I want to play, might as well. There's no disc. Buy digitally. Your suffering came in, just as it has for our eldest daughter, who has joined us in communion, and now she is of our flesh, of our blood. My faithful disciple will show her the path. Go oh, now. Deliver to these vagrant children their salvation. As you wish. I wonder if I could have killed that thing down there or I don't remember. I'll make it cheaper. There you go. Seems like it worked. 
Bad news? All we've done is buy you some time. This presence effects will wear off all too soon. You ready to go? Don't worry about me. Ashley is the priority. In that case, we know what we have to do. And come, Sancho Panta! Let us rescue the Princess Dulcinea! You gotta hurt yourself. Hey, that was my dance. Okay, hurry, I get it. All right. What's up? Uh. <laughs> no need to be suspicious. Just five more chapters left. Might be done with this today. Blah, 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 blah. Lore. I know somebody's like, man, you're supposed to read that stuff and you're supposed to let us read it. Um, no, I'm just playing. The DSP. You didn't answer my question. What are you after? I just want to feel good about myself. Make amends. Something like that. Okie dokie. Let's see. We got. Uh. Yeah. Let's see. Craft. No, no, no. Oh, yeah. Welcome. I got something new for you. Anything else I can help you with? <sighs> Let's keep on moving. I wonder if I could, uh, Take out those bats and would I get an item? Maybe if I remember to do it, I'll try it next time. Hey, since when was this a dead end? This used to lead to the exit. I guess that's uh, any dynamite. Uh, yeah, yep. Chainsaw, dude. Wonder what they saying. If you don't you know what to do. I got this. Oh, it got him too. Threw a grenade right below me. Bro, what is up with these grenades?
Let's go ahead and use this. We max health. Wow, ain't that a ain't that about a B? Dang grenade, man! I'm telling you, these dudes with the grenades been messing me up all game. Wow, got hit in the face with a pipe or a shovel. That's what I'm talking about. Wow, bro. Like, seriously? What, what is this doing with this shovel? I hear somebody on the side of me. I'm not even going to risk it, bro. See, yo, he would have he, he would have clocked me one time and then it would have been over. Take her out now. Can't stand them people with them grenades. Give me a hand here. It'll help. Do something, would you? It it would have made more sense if they uh like gave me ability to like do a, a kick or something instead of wasting a bullet but i mean other resident evil games let you do this like if they get captured you hit them with a melee i guess i could have knifed them but i don't know if doing that would have hurt them or something whatever some dynamite going off. If I run into a yellow, I could still possibly do it. Where is it out here? It's squeaking. Trying to get the big bucks again.
Should make quick work of that dead end. Uh. Oh, wow. I didn't think about that. Okay. Do I have to fight everybody again? Wow. I don't. Thank you. I was not thinking about that as a possibility. It is funny though. I'm pretty sure a lot of people got killed by that. Or it was just me. And I'm stupid. Either way. Let's try this again. Now, remember I was talking about in a past video about like no returns and like rubble block and stuff. I guess this would be equivalent to a less. No, nah, never mind. I'm stupid. I talked too soon. You can get passed through that way. But in, in any other instance, they might have blocked all this off to let you know, oh, you can't go back that way again. You handle yourself pretty well. You sure you're just a researcher? I'm just an average guy who happens to be quite the ladies man. <laughs> Such a gentleman. Let's go. How much you want to bet people are going to say, oh man, this is like the God of War ogres. Like, there's so many of them. You fight them like a thousand times. Like, oh, let's go ahead and do some mixing. Craft. Grabbed. 
both should have fell in. Did both fall in? Nope. I bet you there's some type of achievement or trophy like to do this without dropping them in the hatch. Dang. He got armor on, like, I guess I got to shoot at his head. Shit, can't get through the armor. Sorry, you have a friend PC for me. Where do you think you're... Not risking it. Got his ass kicked. Beautiful. Just as planned. All right. Let's finish this guy off. I just noticed something in this boss fight Leon zoom in is small it's not like super zoomed in so remember I told you guys like there's a mod on PC to make the zoom in not that intense it's already in the game it's just for certain fights and stuff I guess it see, see how it's super zoomed in now I wonder how this looks on my PC. Because my PC is definitely better than the PS4, but is it better than a PS5? It might be on par with a PS5, but you're not suggesting we ride this thing. Do you see any other way? Let's go ahead and say 